Electric Shepherd, Chicho, are you foreseeing a world war situation sometime? Yeah, yeah. I think we're in a world war right now. It's, it's cyber warfare, it's economic warfare, it's ideological warfare, and it's global. And yeah, like, look, gang, people, people, I, I said, I basically wrote an article saying, what was the title of the article? And this, I started writing, putting this article together um, in 2006, right? In 2006, 2007, I wrote this article, in, and this is what it was called. Collapsing the economy in the build-up to World War III. Seven of the most important economic events of the last seven years. And that article, I think I put out in 2006 or 2007. And the last version of that article I put out in 2009, I think, or 2010. And I called it Collapsing the Economy in the Build-Up to World War III. Eleven of the most important economic events of the last 11 years, right? And I took different economic events that said, okay, this is important, this is important, this is what's going on, right? And at the time, I was writing this article about collapsing the economy. The U.S. economy, global economy, was a full throttle. Everybody's partying. Everybody's making money. I'm coming up with an article saying the economy is going to collapse. People are like, what the hell are you talking about? I go, look, man, there's a shitstorm coming, right? And I was writing about this in 2006, right? Two years before the economic collapse, right, the downturn. Some people read those articles took my points to heart, saved themselves a shitload of money, okay, didn't lose their homes and stuff like this. Some people, a lot of people, some people actually, those articles were hitting the front pages of multiple places, right? Uh, some people uh, questioned some of my theories and they were correct, some of the stuff I got wrong, right? However, the thesis was there, the main idea was there, yeah. They were collapsing the economy to kick up the wars because they needed more wars to feed the beast feed this economic system we're in that situation right now right so we are in world war three right now right stutniks was a nuclear weapon cyber nuclear weapon used on iran okay i don't think people really appreciate what that was okay a virus specifically created to hit iranian nuclear sites that got out of control and was spreading around the world right and they really didn't know how destructive this virus could have been because that could have started it a huge catastrophe in iran poisoned huge landmass with radiation right that was a cyber nuclear weapon going off for some reason it really didn't hit people's radar. It hit a lot of people that know programming and they've been online for a long time. There's a documentary that came out of it, uh, came from it. It's a fantastic documentary talking about that thing, right? Laying it out, saying, look, this is gigantic, right? That event right there kicked us off into a new age, just like the dropping of the bombs on, on Nagasaki and Hiroshima kicked us off into the atomic age. That event right there kicked us off into the cyber age the cyber nuclear age whatever you want to call it i don't know what the what the term has been decided on right 